tow truck. That's cool. I ain't got nowhere to go. Snatch and grab, boys. What's going on everybody? Bully Kid here. And you know, we just had more snow. I'll show you outside here. We had a lot more snow a couple days ago. And you know, driving in the snow, now compared to the review I gave you guys earlier, is a lot different, okay? When there was a little bit of snow, car handled fine. Obviously, there's traction issues, but you can go where you need to go, especially on main roads. Now that I drove in it with a little bit of more snow, um, I definitely can see the the negatives of these tires in the snow. Honestly, I probably rate these things now in the snow. I'd probably say five out of ten. Um, they do okay when you're just driving normally, not accelerating or cornering higher. At higher speeds than you should be driving when it's in the snow um, I previously had contact extreme contact tires I, I believe they were continentals I could be wrong though and comparing these brand new tires to even my used continentals or extreme contact tire uh, those handle a lot better you had a lot more feedback a lot more traction in all conditions in the snow so I mean uh, definitely you have to expect some negatives with these tires I'm just pointing it out to you if you can live with it if you do need a great snow tire <clears throat> I probably this wouldn't be my first first bet there's there's probably six to ten cheaper tires on the market and you know I'm just testing one of them out for you guys so uh, my other complaint that I've kind of noticed before which was the noise the road noise I said it wasn't that bad you know but it, I, I've been noticing it more and more especially on highway you, you hear that like like the tire isn't a soft compound you hear it's like a, a rougher harder compound and you hear the road noise definitely it's becoming a little bit more irritating um, gotta live with it but the snow performance and and the noise definitely could be improved on these tires now stay tuned and I'm gonna do another review on a different tire on a different vehicle <clears throat> and I'm gonna review the Achilles ATR sports version 1 tire and I'll give you my feedback on those and I'll compare it to the Doro tires as well. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Hope this update helps you determine whether these are right for you or not.